you are not going to be able to triangulate how awesome this story is. Illuminati, Illuminati. <laughs> to my channel. I always do that every video. I don't know, I'm sure you can make a compilation of that, but nobody has the time. Okay, anyways guys, today I just want to sit you down in an actual location where something crazy, crazy happened. My name is Matthew Benavides, and I am 21 years old, and I had an encounter with a, with a devastating creature. <laughs> known as, I'm sorry. First of all, let me give you a little backstory to this story. As the title suggests, this is the sorry monster. I am a college student, and as any college student would know, free food is the equivalent to finding a soulmate. There's this church really close to the college campus, and every Thursday, they give free food. So of course, being the wise college student I am, I go for the free food. But um, today I was at the church a bit earlier and um, the free food usually starts at 11.30. But this time I was at the church like two hours early, you know, gotta beat that rush, you know what I mean? So I was there at 9.30. And I'm just sitting at the couch with some friends and all of a sudden this guy comes up. He's wearing glasses, he has long blonde hair, like maybe flows down to right here. A little on the bigger side, kind of my size. It caught on in a fly and, um, maybe a few inches shorter than me. With his Boba Fett backpack, he walks in, he's wearing a Hawaiian t-shirt with, a, I think it was like a Back to the Future shirt under it. And um, it's 9.30 a.m., you have to remember this. He goes up and says, Oh, excuse me, like, is there free food? I, I thought the free food was today. Like, I'm sorry, I just really thought it was today. It's 9.30 a.m. The free food, the lunch, as it is, doesn't start at 9.30 a.m. It usually starts at lunchtime. <laughs> He did the monster man. Um, nah, dude. Uh, it's usually a free lunch and it's, uh, 9.30. It was a great- Oh, I I I'm really sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Like, I didn't mean to, to offend you or anything. So this guy, everything we're saying, he's responded with sorry to. He's just sorry, sorry, sorry. And you have to realize, this guy has that deep radio voice. This guy randomly starts talking about Marvel. I just, I just really don't like Wolverine because, you know, he doesn't have morals. Um, wait. Wolverine doesn't have morals, um, I'm pretty sure he does. Um, I don't really think he does at all, you know, I'm sorry, I don't mean to offend you or anything, I'm just really sorry, but I don't really like Wolverine because, um, he, he's just so serious when he kills people, you know, I prefer Deadpool because when he kills people, at least he has morals and he laughs about it, you know? The monster match, for my love notari in the castle east. What? He's claiming Deadpool has morals and Wolverine doesn't because Deadpool laughs when he kills somebody? <sighs> so yeah, so this guy's claiming that Wolverine has morals and Deadpool, well, Wolverine doesn't have morals and Deadpool does. Go figure. So yeah, this guy's just arguing constantly back and forth how Deadpool has morals and Wolverine doesn't. And finally, he's about to leave. He's like, oh, uh, I have to leave right now. Like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, hey, is that World of Warcraft? He, he sees my friend playing World of Warcraft. Yeah, man, it, it is. Oh, really? I hate that game. Yeah! Now, I'm not a big World of Warcraft fan, necessarily. Uh, I'm not part of the Legion. I can still make puns about World of Warcraft. But... Um, this guy was being a total troll. Another pun. I, th I think there's trolls in World of Warcraft. I'm committing complete heresy if there aren't. But, but no, so then, he's, he's just, he's just being wild, and you know, he's just, we're, they're going back and forth arguing about World of Warcraft, and then, um, some time passes, and, uh, finally the food gets there, and, and, um, it's maybe before the lunch starts, they have some chips out there, and uh, he asked her, um, can I have one of these bag of chips? Oh, uh, no, not yet, man. Uh, we're sorry. Um, just uh, wait till 11.30. Hey, I'm, I'm real sorry. Like, I just, I don't want to offend you. I just really thought I could have some. He's saying sorry for everything. And then he's standing there, and I go, hey, man, you want to sit down? No, I'm sorry. Like, I know it's a little weird that I stand, but uh, I just, I'm just real sorry. No, I, I'm going to sit down. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to freak y'all out. Why would we be freaked out that you're sitting down? 
I don't know. This guy's saying sorry to everything, and it was honestly one of the funniest, oddest things that happened to me. And I have a lot of funny, odd things happen to me. I look in the mirror every day, and I'm like, hey, that's really funny. Then I realize it's me. Hey guys, no, that was just a little story of my encounter with the sorry monster. Um, totally wild. Um, I love college. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope this mini story kept y'all entertained. And um, Be sure to give me a like, shoot a comment. If you've had any encounters with someone in college, it's a bit different or unique. And also make sure to subscribe. We're so close to hitting 100 subscribers. Um, it's really a pleasure and an honor to share my life with you guys. Uh, someone's calling. All right, God bless you guys. That's like the perfect way to end, end a video with someone calling. All right, God bless. To my love notari in the castle east Bye. To the master bedroom where the vampires